master pages and text variables. Our goals for this lecture are to understand what master pages are. We'll define what a master page is and practice creating our own master pages. We'll then use those master pages within a design. I'll show you how to add text and objects to a master page so they can be repeated throughout a design or an InDesign project. And then I'll show you how to apply those master pages to various pages within your project. I'll also show you how to create a master page from an existing page in your document and how to import or share master pages with, between InDesign documents. We'll also talk about the idea of overriding master page elements and then I'll show you how to fix that by removing local overrides. And last, we will talk about the idea or the concept behind text variables. I will specifically show you how to create automatic page numbering, but the idea of text variables is, is a bigger concept than we're going to cover in this lecture. So what is a master page? A master page is a template used in Adobe InDesign that allows users to repeat an element more than one time. If something repeats in exactly the same way on more than one page, like a logo or a newsletter header, it should be placed on a master page for easy editing. Master pages can be singular or multiple pages, and as you can see from my screenshot here, the A master in this example is a two-page master, while the B master is a single or one-page master. Automatic page numbering can and should be applied to your master pages. Each page of your document can only have one master page applied. That is a fact about master pages. So it's only physically possible to have A master applied to your page or B master at any one given time. Now I'll show you the idea I'll talk about later in the lecture, the idea of nesting master pages. And if you nest a master page, you can see the items from multiple master pages applied to a, a singular page within your project. But technically, only one master page can be applied at a time. It can only apply either at master A or master B in this example here. When you have multiple page masters, like our A master example, all right-hand page masters apply to right-hand pages within your document, and all left-hand pages apply to the left-hand pages within your document. If you have a singular or a single page master, like our B master example, it doesn't matter where I apply B master to. If it lands on a right or a left-hand side page, the result will be the same. It will just copy whatever is on master B in exactly the same place, location, size, etc. Um, from the master page. 